Smart business people know it often takes a gimmick to sell products. Well, if you own a restaurant, you sometimes need more than good food to attract customers. And as Lynn Brown now reports, there's one establishment that's singing a Looney Tune to drum up business. There's nothing like it, nothing else around. Gadgets, gadgets, the only girl in town. He's Sammy Sands, and he's a robot. He's the star attraction at Westbury, Long Island's newest attraction, a place called Gadgets, a unique sort of restaurant with lots of gadgets on display and computerized entertainment. There's just about everything from airplane propellers to washboards, and everywhere you look, the moving objects get your attention. It's a combination of antique, amusement park, and high technology all rolled into one. And Candace Adams with Warner Leisure Company, which is responsible for gadgets, says she expects the idea to really take off. Dining out is one of the fastest growing leisure activities of the 1980s, and I think we're getting a more and more sophisticated audience that expects good food, but they want to be entertained. And we want to entertain them and give them a place that's fun to come to, where they can spend the entire evening. There's also a very special attraction for the kids, and the kid in all of us. It's a robot cast of Looney Tunes characters, and what a show they put on. Yes, sir. We're going to take you back to the golden days of the cinema. And then there's the food, and the executive chef, Mike Huffler, likes to think that his dishes make a gadget of a difference. This is what we call our... Uh, giant nacho platter and it's in a giant basket made of a flour tortilla with taco chips and chili con queso sauce but we have many pasas on the menu and then we have fresh homemade uh, desserts on the menu this is a chocolate 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 cake <laughs> one of the other unique things about the restaurant is the laboratory that's where the bartenders do their thing and robert tells me that one of the specialties of the bar is something called a sammy's whammy named after that guy over there behind the piano. And believe me, after you've had one or two of these, it doesn't matter whether he's human or humanoid. I'm Lynn Brown, Independent Network News in Westbury, New York.